Hello, we are excited to introduce Relto Integration Hub that provides a low-code, no-code capability for building integrations, data pipelines, and annotations. Intended for digital citizens, it provides an agile foundation for unifying your organization's data through pre-built connectors, easy-to-use drag-and-drop interface, enabling faster integration process, as well as providing visibility and centralized control of data integrations. In this demo, we will go through the experience of creating a recipe to integrate HubSpot with RELTIO. The use case being, whenever a new contact is created or updated in HubSpot, it is also replicated to RELTIO. Integration Hub is available in the app launcher on the Hub UI. This is a new uh, application also available through console. We will select the project where we want to place the recipe and click on the create recipe button. We provide a unique name for the integration recipe, leads from HubSpot. Next, we will move to select a starting point for this recipe. Let's select trigger from an app. As you can see, you can choose other types of starting points like run on a schedule, webhook, or even an API endpoint, depending on how and which system you want to integrate Relteo with. This takes us to the next screen, wherein we will build the recipe. A recipe consists of a trigger and a set of actions that are executed when the trigger event is generated. On the right hand side panel, we select the application for the trigger event. Right up front, you can see that all your connected and frequently used applications are at the top of the panel. You can also search for your application in the search or select from the list by clicking on select all apps. For the trigger app, we will choose HubSpot and after this, we will choose our trigger event. As you can see, all available triggers provided with HubSpot connector. For this demo, let's select new updated contact and then the HubSpot connection we want to use. Next, we will leave the trigger setups as default. The step-by-step -step guide at the top makes it easy to navigate through the various steps and create an integration with the source application. Now that the trigger has been set up, we will move to the set, uh, setup of actions. Here, we will select an action to evaluate the condition, such as if there is an associated company linked with the contact. Depending on your recipe logic, you can select the other operations like repeat action, exception handling, or even call other recipes. With such operations, you can build various kinds of transformation and orchestration within the integration pr process without writing a single line of code. Next, we will select the field from the trigger defined in step one that we want to check the conditions with. In the data tree, you can view all the fields from the connected HubSpot application. And with the click of a button, we can create uh, the if condition. You can maximize the data tree to give, your, give you more view to read the data build descriptions, browse nested fields, or even search for specific fields. Here we will say if the data field, which is associated company ID, of the contact is present, then we will select an application for our action. Similar to trigger setup, you can quickly scan your connected apps and other related apps for your action. Here we will choose Relteo. Again, we will select an action from the list, create record, and connect to the Relteo tenant in which we are building this recipe. Move to map the Relteo contact fields uh, with the data from HubSpot contact. Let's create the mapping for name and email address attributes, as well as also provide the crosswalk values. The Relteo connector, also provided along with Integration Hub, offers an extensive list of operations like search, get, match, merge, and various others to simplify the integration process with Relteo. We can also perform data transformations, for example, concatenate the first and the last name to update the full name. We will add a create record for organization, entity. We also follow the same steps, which is select Relteo for app, select the connection, and pick the create record action. This time, we will select the entity organization and map the company ID to crosswalk and name into organization name of Relteo. Lastly, since there is an association between the two entities, we will also create the relation between the contact and organization.
you can see how you can build transformation by selecting the formula type of the field. Built Integration Hub provides various kinds of built-in functions to make it easy for you to build such transformations. Throughout this process of building the integration recipe, you will notice how with simple mouse clicks we build integrations with source applications. Accessing and building the data mappings for any step in the recipe is as simple as clicking on that step, seeing the configurations of the step on the right hand side panel and selecting the fields from the data tree to map it with the target fields. Now that we are done with our recipe, we can save and test. With Relative Integration Hub, building and deploying recipes has never been simpler, faster, and efficient.